And millions of charities around the world are poised to do incredible things, but they're struggling. And they're struggling because they lack the in-house expertise that everyone in this room collectively has. So I want to ask a question. Raise your hand if you volunteered somewhere in the last month. OK, right? Some people. Raise your hand if you would volunteer if there was a clear way to help and it wasn't that difficult and you knew that it was going to have a huge impact for that charity. Right? Almost everyone in the room. So keep that thought. How many people here have heard of something called Startup Weekend? Cool. All right. These are amazing events for the people that don't know. A Startup Weekend, uh, it's a global movement at any given point in the world. Uh, on a Saturday, there's probably five to ten of these running all over the world. And these are events where a hundred people come together and work uh, to launch a product from zero to launch in the course of a weekend. And they're amazing. I've been to nine of them. I ran three of them. I'm a huge proponent of these things um, for so many reasons. But you learn so much. You meet cool people. It's kind of the same reason that we're all here on this boat. Uh, very similar thing. But you learn these skills in the pursuit of actually working on something real and building a real product. The only problem with these events is that they're wasteful. Because at the end of the weekend, nine times out of 10, that product just gets abandoned and it's all that collective hours that people spent working on something just goes away. What I'm proposing is something, uh, nothing short of building a global movement, except instead of building these vaporware products that just get thrown away, we actually pair up with local charities and we get all the same benefits of working in the similar format as Startup Weekend, only to advance the cause of a local charity. Right? So I call this Charity Makeover. This was a movement that I started um, not too long ago. We've done four events. Uh, we worked with Seeds for Autism, Tumbleweed Youth Shelter, um, Veteran Tickets, and the recent one was a monkey sanctuary in Cordoba, Argentina. You guys, in, the, in a weekend, 14 people built a website, a crowdfunding platform. We implemented a CRM system so they could track their volunteers. We implemented an accounting system and we made them a professional video. That's 14 people in the course of a weekend that did that. Can you imagine what the collective brain power of this boat is? Yeah, yeah. Can you imagine like, what could we do with just the people in this room, just the brain power that's here? Think what we could do if we work together in a coordinated fashion. So you guys, everyone here has a unique gift. You wouldn't be here if you weren't a badass at something. Clearly you can afford to be on this boat and you're good at something. So think about like, I'm not gonna stop you from like cleaning a beach or volunteering in a soup kitchen. Those are all like noble things. But think about what you could do if we could all work together and just very periodically contribute our skills in a coordinated fashion and advance the cause for charity. So my ask for everyone in the room is that you consider uh, going to charitymakeover.com, uh, hit the volunteer button. Actually, does this appeal to anyone? Is there anyone who would do this in the room? Yeah. Can I get a fuck yeah if you would do this? <laughs> okay. All right. So uh, ordinarily, I'd say go to charitymakeover.com, we're at C, so there's no data. So I put a sign-up sheet in back. If there's enough interest in this, just put your email on there and I will contact you. If there's enough interest, um, we'll do one in Lisbon while we're there. So, yeah. all right, charitymakeover.com, thank you, you guys.